Hi friends, this is Dr. Sirisha. Welcome back to my channel Healthy Magic Foods. Please subscribe, share and like my YouTube channel Healthy Magic Foods. Now I am going to show you how to make curry with ice apple. Ice apple we call it as Munjalu in Telugu and Nunju in Tamil. This ice apple is a seasonal fruit you get during summer. That low calorie fruit and very good for health it contains lot of vitamins phytonutrients and fiber phytonutrients are very helpful and hydrates the body during summer it contains c vitamin a e and k it also improves the digestive system it has fiber as it is low calorie diabetic people and the health conscious people Calorie conscious people can easily take this fruit. When it is tender, you can easily have it. I can enjoy ice apple. But when it is little harder, those fruits can be used for making curry. A tasty curry which you can eat with roti, chapati, any roti like jowar roti or vajra or ragi roti. You can also have with puri and fried rice or dalia. To make ice apple curry, take ice apples, don't take the tender ones, see they are little strong, very tender ones you cannot cook them and take one small onion, green chilies, two tomatoes, curry leaves and ginger garlic. As per your taste, you take the, if you have the ginger garlic paste, you can use the ginger garlic paste, coriander and one small piece of dry coconut and dry fruits of your choice. You can even use ground nuts. So this is used to make the gravy. Now you peel them off, peel them off and make into one inch pieces. Peel them off with spoon like this. I have already peeled few of them. I am taking 5 pieces now. It is easy to peel with a spoon rather than with a knife. Because it is too soft, you cannot peel with a knife. Keep a pan on stove, heat it and add oil. Along with these ingredients, you need little garam masala also. If you like the taste of garam masala, add garam masala, otherwise you can avoid it. Try to take the little tougher ones but not too tough ones. Tender ones we can eat easily but these ones, little tougher ones, we cannot eat them. So we can make curries and it is going to be very tasty. Add two spoons of oil just to fry these. Then add onion. Fry a little. Then cut tomatoes and add. Cut big pieces because we are going to grind them add green chilies garlic Cut ginger into pieces and add it to it. Squeeze up ginger. And dry fruits. 
If you want, you can add even ground nuts or sesame seeds. Sesame seeds, but you have to fry them separately and make powder. If you add ground nuts, it, you can add to the this fry itself. Fry a little. Once this tomato is half done, then we go for blending. Fry them. This tomato is almost half cooked. See, it is half cooked. Now we transfer it into a mixer jar. Switch off the stove. Now, so little oil is there. We add some more oil. Very little, half spoon of oil. Cut ice ice apple into pieces. Add ice apple to the pan and fry it. Add half spoon of turmeric. And fry them, and little salt. Once it is fried, we add the gravy. Now we blend the gravy. Add curry leaves. Cut this dry coconut into pieces and add it to this jar so that we can make fine paste of it. Now it is fried. Water to this to make fine paste. Now it is fried nicely. See, cooked also. It is also cooked See, very nicely. Now we add this paste to this. We have already added three green chillies. We no need to add chilli powder. If you want, you can add little butter. One inch cube of butter. It tastes like butter paneer. 
Now add half spoon of jeera powder. Half spoon of garam masala. Finally, we add salt and coriander. This curry is going to be very good for chapatis, fried rice and dalia. Done. We add coriander. Add coriander. We can serve it hot. Switch off the stove and transfer it into a bowl. Add a piece of butter and serve hot. Tasty, healthy ice apple curry. Ready.